Greetings and welcome to another episode of Trippy Food. I'm coming at you from Trippy Food East. You know me, it's your girl, Julie Coos. And over there on the West Coast, we have the OG, the man himself, Val, over in Trippy Food West. Well, or just it's trippy. Uncle Val, your trippy pal. <laughs> and today we have a, another episode of Snack Attack. Dad, what do we have for them today? We are going to try the brand new goldfish spicy dill pickle or is it spicy dill pickle goldfish oh, you know nice. one way or the other it's from i, I don't remember but pepperidge farm remembers <laughs> it's a pepperidge <laughs> farm product and so that you know that joke there we go never mind so these are brand new i've had some difficulty finding these i actually had to order them from walmart online julie you got yours from market basket where you get more for your dollar so they're in different places but uh, they're still a little bit elusive, but we both managed to get these. And so what we decided ahead of time is that we're going to try these, but just in case they don't really deliver, we're going to pickle them up a little bit, right? So yeah. we're going to try them as is first. Now I'm looking at the outside of it. There's this weird like pickle tower going on here. I don't know what's yeah. going on with that. Like are the fish swimming past the, it? The fish are on fire a little bit. But also, yeah. I did notice that, now granted, it is a goldfish product, but it does look like it's a little bit on the mild side, right? In the well, it's in between food. mild and hot. So it's like medium, but to be yeah. to be fair, I can't think of a single goldfish that they've released that was supposed to be spicy that was actually like, spi like I don't know if, if that meter has ever come go into the red zone. Like, no. I've never seen a Carolina Reaper goldfish or anything like that. So honestly, that's probably because, uh, you know, God forbid little Timmy gets one of those in his lunch by accident, you know? Yeah, then they'll no. stop making them forever. Yeah. So uh, so I I, I'm, I have reservations about it. I, I doubt that it's going to be spicy just because, just from past experience that, you know. And, and again, like you said, these are probably things that you would give a kid. And maybe you don't want to yeah. give kids something that's not that spicy and everything. And so maybe they kind of tone it down. But it does say medium and not mild. Right. But, you know. Regardless. They are kind of a big deal. Just I'm so kind know. of a big deal. Kind of a big deal. Yeah. Just so we're gonna, so we're gonna try them, and again, we're gonna try them as is first, and um, and then now, uh, judging by this, again, this is your typical goldfish, which is orange, and it's usually orangey because it's cheese flavored. These guys uh, look a little bit more pale, although it doesn't say that there's any cheese in them, right? Right, you know, like I, those little baby goldfish are like saltine flavored, so maybe that's the base they'll use. What? Yeah, they're not baby flavored. Sorry. I thought they were baby flavored, or mm -hmm. or so, like maybe they were using baby seasoning. You know, like the seasoning you use when oh, you're making yeah, baby. Oh, like baby powder. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> maybe that's what it is. That's disappointing. So, I know. And I'm not gonna try the baby ones because you know, I don't taste. <laughs> they don't taste like baby. All right, so let's just. Ooh, that's there. that's very dilly smelling. Oh yeah, it smells Super like you. You know what? You know what it smells like? Yeah, it's like it's like that uh, that smell that's in the jar in the pickle jar after you're you're all done and you're gonna rinse it out. That smell that's still in the pickle jar. That's kind of what that smells like. So, and I noticed that these have like little flecks in them. Yes. And little smiles. Yeah. See. The snack that smiles back, goldfish. Do is that their thing? Do they, yeah. do they say that? Yeah, which is kind of disturbing if you really think about it. The snack that smiles back. It is. All right, well, let's try these. Wow. I mean, wow. Seriously, wow. That's like that's like a smack in the face pickle. Well, all right. I, wow. I didn't mean to put that visual in your face <laughs> it's like pickle juice right don't say that three times when he comes to life <laughs> <laughs> pickle juice pickle juice pickle juice um and then there's that spice that comes in at the end of it but, but yeah there's I, a nice little back of your throat heat but there's there's that there's that vinegar and that dill flavor mm. so it's like some of the some of the things like some of the pickle flavored things and you either and you go like yeah, i'm not getting it i'm not getting it you get that right off the bat it's like it's like they're soaked in pickle juice and then you, know you get that spice that comes in afterwards. They are, they are, they have a mild cheese flavor too. I sucked the the topping off of it, I guess, and just let it dissolve. And it does have like that very mild cheddar flavor. These are really good. These are like, 
a shockingly good because Excellent. because I, I honestly thought like you know they say pickle flavor dill pickle flavor they, blah, 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 but it's there I mean, it is there. We, re- we, re- we reviewed a lot of pickle flavored things, as has uh, Reckless Eating. And I, this is going to be one of the top, um, you know, dill pickle flavored things that I've had. Now, there's and no the heat and the heat, you know, but there's no pickle in here, right? There's no like cucumber in here. Uh, no cucumber, but um, there is salt, no filled milk spices including celery citric acid because there's citric acid in everything uh garlic and onion powders red chili peppers and um vinegar powder huh. so that's probably why it hits you so much is because the the powder's on top of it you know how do you it's powderize excellent. how do you powderize vinegar it's really good now it says spices so it doesn't say dill perhaps but i'm getting that right yeah i'm not getting too, i'm seeing I'm, it too I mean, when you look at it, there's de- there's definitely um, those little flecks of uh, yeah of dill. Yes, yeah. uh, those are really really good. Now, so before we started, uh, Julie and I agreed. So so cause, be, just because we we anticipated disappointment, so what we said was we're gonna pickle it up, all right? And now we're so, eating our words. Yeah, and, and our goldfish. literally, literally. <laughs> so we're gonna step it up a little bit. So wh- what are you gonna do, Jules? Um, these are ones that we have review- we reviewed when you were here. This is uh, Mount Olive's Majestic Pickle Reap Premium. Pickle Reap pre- pre- uh, Medium Heat Hot Sauce Savory Kosher Baby Dills. And these were excellent, if you remember uh, the garlic and everything in there. They're really good. So um, what are you planning so to do with those? I'm just going to cut up a pickle and kind of slip them in the middle like an envelope. Or like a sandwich, if you will. Okay. The and so, the bread. And so what I'm going to do is this. So this is Hidden Valley Ranch pickle flavored Ooh. ranch dressing now this isn't new so that's why i didn't make a big deal out of it you know this is a big deal new, a big <laughs> it's kind of a big deal <laughs> um that's why I, I kind of didn't make a big deal out of this because this has been around for about a year but i've just only recently saw it so i thought i'm gonna get this and i'm gonna use it because it says right there great for dipping so we're gonna go ahead and dip so let me put a little bit here I put three pieces in, and I'm just gonna cut it to down to one. Oh, well, it kind of looks like a Pac-Man. I, I had a bunch of them in there, but now I. <laughs> it's it's like a it's like a goldfish flume ride. <laughs> exactly. Where the, where the where the goldfish don't know they're gonna die. <laughs> <laughs> now good. I'm get I'm guessing by the flavor of these that really the only thing that that does is add some texture, right? Exactly. Um, in fact, like the the cracker just kind of soaked in a little bit of the juice but honestly it, i mean it doesn't it doesn't help or hurt it but, but you um, almost you almost can't tell it's there yeah exactly yeah, it, yeah. It, now do you find that the pickle is spicier than the goldfish or the goldfish is big you know is gold i think they're spicy, even so? to be honest with you I, and i think that with the goldfish and these pickles that we had before i think that it's a building heat i think if you were to eat a bunch of these at a time or like you know were to have whatever the serving suggestion is by the time you're having your like fifth goldfish, the heat's building a little bit. Let me try the Hidden Valley Ranch pickle flavored ranch dressing. Okay, that's nice because the Hidden Valley Ranch actually has cucumber in it. Oh, so you do okay. get that pickle flavor, but you get the ranch flavor, which you don't get from the goldfish themselves. Mm-hmm. So you're getting the ranch flavor, but you, and you're getting the, the the extra pickle flavor that's in here. But you're also getting that cucumber flavor that kind of brings it all home and really makes it, t- it taste pickly. You know what? All of these things I bet would be good. So the goldfish, the pickles, the ranch would be great if you were doing like a, a pickle charcuterie board. What would you call that? A, a picuterie? <laughs> this is really, really good. I was kind of voiced for disappointment because Same. typically in the past, you know, when you have something, especially it's supposed to be spicy pickle flavor and they don't deliver, but this definitely delivers. So it just by themselves, excellent. Fantastic. Thumbs up. Thumbs Fantastic. Up. Now, do I think that the kiddos will like it? Pro- probably not. unless Because of the spice? I think because of the spice and also like some kids love like salt and vinegar, but it, it is like it hits you like it's strong. It is a little bit spicy, I think, to give to a kid. So the texture wise, it's got like the powder on it, like the extra pizza blast or whatever, the those cheddar ones. That's kind of what it's got going on. You got yours at Market Basket. 
Uh, I got mine online. I had to order them from Walmart. They're difficult to get if you you know if you can find them. Could be that they're just not all out yet and everywhere, right. and we might see these popping up in the next few weeks. They are limited edition though, so if you do see them, grab them because I don't know how long they're going to be out there. This could be like the tail end of it or something like that, but definitely grab them. If you want to dress it up, that's fine, but just buy themselves. They're really good. I couldn't sit down and eat a whole bag of these just because of that mm-hmm. vinegar and everything. Yeah. So you know, I just eat a handful, and they're they're really really nice. So you should get out there and get get these if you can find them and give them a shot. But Remember that it's crazy out there, so please be careful. Take care of yourself. Take care of others. We'll see you soon. Be careful with that knife, Julie. (laughs) Hi, everybody. Thanks for checking out Trippy Food. If you enjoyed watching that video half as much as I did making it, well, then I enjoyed it twice as much as you did. And if that's the case, you'll probably like this video right here. And if not, check out this video right here. That one's a little bit different. Either way, leave a comment down below. And be sure to subscribe by clicking on the Trippy Food icon right here. Glad you could make it, and we hope to see you again soon.